I wake up at 5 a.m. I get up and head into the shower. And I get out and brush my teeth. After that, I style my hair just a little bit to get it out of my face. I always lay out my uniform the night before so I can get ready as fast as I can. My brothers and I have to be ready and in the car by 6.40 or we hit some traffic, which would lead to more than 50 minutes sitting in the car just to get to school. I take the one or two bus from Indian Trail to Civic Center, which is usually 30 minutes depending on traffic. I arrive to Civic Center at 7.04 or 7.12 and I wait along with other students as well. I get on and it takes two or three minutes to get to North Avenue. From North Avenue, you just have to walk the street across to be by the school. I found out about Crystal Ray through my church when I was in seventh grade. I was immediately intrigued. I wanted to go mainly for the corporal work study program. When I found out that I had gotten accepted into Crystal Ray, I was extremely overwhelmed with happiness. I was super excited and I couldn't wait to go. Crystal Ray is different in many ways from other schools I've been to. First off, none of those schools had a corporate work-study program, and there were way more people in the classrooms and the whole school. Also, there were no uniforms. On the days we work, we go downstairs to the lunchroom to receive announcements. Then we get to Smith's to head to work. At times, the march rations are so packed that we have to wait for another one to come. When we arrive at work, we greet our supervisor. We check our email on the computer, then follow the normal schedule. Usually we make coffee and wipe off the tables in the conference rooms. Coming here at first, I was too shy to talk to anyone about anything or ask for help. But as time passed, I got more involved with projects and talking to the president and even the CEO. At iVision, I have learned that asking questions is okay when you don't understand something. To keep track of things and to not be shy when talking on the phone or to somebody in real life. My mentor at iVision, Albert, has definitely helped me out tremendously. He's helped me solidify and pinpoint a career that I feel is my true calling. I've learned from him to be open to different things and to take them into consideration. He's taught me to work smarter, not harder. Mary is my mentor, and when she asked me about what my interests were, I said writing. She told me about how her daughter does the same thing. She told me about how everything I do actually does matter, big or small. I leave iVision at 3.30 and do the five minute walk back. I take the southbound train from our center to North Avenue. I return to school, sign in, and sit down to fill in my time card. I usually go straight home in the afternoons, unless it's a Thursday. Then I stay for art and design club. I like staying because I get to spend time with my best friends and draw or just socialize. My afternoons are pretty much the same throughout the week. I get home and take a nap. After my wonderful nap, I wake up and do homework. My life has definitely changed for the better since attending Crystal Ray and working at iVision. I have been exposed to new and important things that are vital in one's life. Since starting Crystal Ray, I have gained a new perspective in the corporate world by watching people do their jobs, learning new things, and meeting a lot of great new people that I probably would have never even met if it wasn't for Crystal Ray. I think my experience both at iVision and Crystal Ray are very positive and helpful for me. From the education to my real life work experience in an actual corporate office.